Hi, my name is Iman and I'm part of the engineering team for the MEDEF National Technologies. So what we are seeing right now is actually the, our first Malaysian armoured vehicle we produced here locally in Malaysia. So we do, uh, at MEDEF we do not do any collaboration with other like, company to make the tarantula itself. So everything is locally made. So we just like, for example, the raw material itself, if you can't find it in Malaysia, then we're going to source outside the country. But the assembler, the assembly, the idea, the design itself is locally made here in Malaysia. So what's special this about Tarantula is, is that is we focus it for recon mission. And even for recon mission, I've asked a lot of our uh, armed personnel, they said that it's quite comfortable compared to other uh, arm, uh, armoured vehicle. So it means that uh, the, when they go to on exercise or on a mission, they will not feel uncomfortable and they can uh, perform the exercise successfully. We have uh, a lot of things that we can do. So this is our first prototype. So in the future, in the future development, for example, if the, our army, if we want to put on new system, we can easily customize it here in Malaysia since we don't do any collaboration. So we can customize it based on their preference. For example, they want to change the threat, the weapon system to a much uh, higher caliber weapon, then we can change it based on what they want as well. So since we just launched it uh, like early 2021, so right, currently we are still having like meeting, undergoing uh, negotiation with the army and the army that is like for example responsible for the uh, for the procurement of the armor vehicle is actually the, the we call the core armor director. So we have still undergoing negotiation, we want to satisfy the preference for what we can put inside the vehicle. And we also have like uh, out of the army from foreign countries as well that has shown interest in our person in our armor vehicle. And so by later this year, maybe like we can, for example, if any of the uh, foreign countries want to have an uh, FAT test with our uh, vehicle, they are welcome to do so. Okay, so the trial is actually is for our own data itself and the trial itself uh, is uh, be done so that we this car is uh, fulfilled what the, the, the reliability that has been uh, set by our army. So if, if like for example everything, the data, the test this has been successfully successfully validated, then then afterwards if they want like to mass produce it, uh, put on different systems on the car, then we can use it. Because without like the initial test, we don't know whether the car, since it's our first made, measurement, we do not we don't know if we, the car is reliable compared like to other foreign assets.